this is Miranda from My Scrappy Life and welcome back to my channel. This is the layout share for the month of August on how to kill a kit with style. I was able to get quite a bit done but not like I wanted to. Only because a bunch of stuff has happened and then I'm getting ready to do scrap timber. Which this kit, once I show you what's left over, is going to roll into September. As there is still a bunch of us that are going to do this as well. But I'm going to use the rest of this kit in the pictures because I still have quite a bit to scrap. But I am at least caught up to where I am on Friday, which this is the day. So I got all of Thursday done, I think. Yeah, I got all of Thursday done. So... I will show you these layouts that I got done and then I'll show you what the kit is left over and this will roll into September. So here is the first picture that I did and this was Saturday night but I wanted this in the beginning as my first layout to my book. And there is, like I said, there's videos to all of these and this I followed a sketch and I'll link all of the videos down below along with all the ladies that um, has participated in it as well. And then this one is of a sketch as well. And then it's also where I set up kind of like how I pack. And I got, you know, there's my outfit for Saturday night that I got. And then that's all of the stuff that I'm taking with. And I already packed the truck or actually the Pathfinder of all of my other stuff, but this is what was left over that I didn't pack yet until Wednesday night when I was getting ready to go for Thursday. Because it happened to be where I wasn't going to leave Thursday to be up there Thursday, but uh, my husband was able to get off work. Because if you guys follow me for a while, you know that he's my grumpy old army dude. And he was able to get off work early for me so that I could be able to go Thursday and be able to help Heather the next day. And this was while I was driving Thursday. This was, a, we call it a stow. It's, you know, a traffic jam, however you want to call it um, here in the States. But in Germany, it's called a stow. And so I stated really a crafty stow. It seems like ever since we've left Germany, I'm telling you, constantly, constantly, we're constantly in traffic jams. I don't get it. So I did a little bit of what Missy Wooden does on the top, and then I did a bunch of strips, and this was a sketch. Almost all of these, except for my latest video, was a sketch. Oh, and this one isn't either. So this here one is of all of my area of where I pack. So... Thursday night, I was able to get everything packed and ready to go and set up at my table. So I already unloaded myself and made my little scrappy area. So I called this layout Fun Times. And I was able to take a glitter pen and I embossed all of these. This is a stamp from Close to My Heart that I used. And like I said, there is a process video for all of these. And here is Thursday's night's food, and I ended up getting sushi because I love sushi and all of that kind of stuff. And so I just went kind of to town on mixed media and played around with it. These were the ladies that went to supper with me. That's Sarah Scraps. There's Heather from Heather's Crafty Life. That's Sarah, um, Sister Melanie, and then there's my face. And... I call this foodies because I was because I'm such a foodie myself that I'm hoping to make them foodies too. So that was kind of that. So those are the layouts that I was able to get done, which I felt was pretty good considering I had everything else going on and whatnot with design teams and that kind of stuff. So here is what's left, and like I said, is going to go and roll over for. Um, September. So these are all of the photos that are left that I'm going to scrap um, hopefully throughout the month of, of September because I am going into scrap timber. So I decided to go with a bunch of ladies 
that wanted to scrap a video a day. I was talking about it and I figured why not do it and that would knock out probably quite a bit of these too. So I'm hoping that I can do that. Obviously, I have my kit in my little kit pack. Of course, I did not use, I didn't dip an ounce into this thing. But that's okay, I'm fine with it because I really love this collection. So I still have quite a bit of the, you know, papers left of that. And then inside here, I have quite a bit of these left over. And it's not that I don't want to use them, I just haven't found the right layout for it. And a bunch of little papers left over. Oh, that I could put this inside here. I'm going to put this inside here so it's all together. All my papers there. Okay. And then I have this paper left over yet. I haven't used that yet. So there's my stickers. Or some of my papers and stickers. Okay, so I still have quite a bit of this alpha, which is the case of the blahs. There's still quite a bit of that left. I did use up quite a bit of this. Now this is almost gone. And this is Let's Dance. So these are almost there. It's almost there. And then I still have quite a bit of this left. It's the Groovy. And I dipped into this one really good. I got quite a bit of this gone. But then also, of course, I still have the second set. And that one's still pretty full yet. That's why I said this one's going to roll into September because i got to try to use it all. And then I've got some of the washi stuff left over yet. And then what else do I have? Oh, I still have these stickers yet. And it says Hello Love right there. And unicorns and sparkles. I still have this type of stuff yet left in here. And I'll find a way to use it. Wait, I got something else in here. Oh, yeah. And then that little guy. And then... So I still have quite a bit of these two packs left, which I'm fine with because I got that 12 by 12 of pad. And then I used quite a bit of these up. And then I still got the second one instead of that. These hearts are pretty well used up. And then there's the felt um, clouds yet still in here. So that is my layout um, share and along with the products that I have. So just remember to go check out everybody else's stuff. It'll be up probably the 31st or the 1st of September, depending. Just remember when you watch this, this is also my kit for September. So I will leave a link down below to everybody that is rolling into September so that you guys know to go check them out because I do know that some is dropping off, some is coming on and all of that kind of stuff and we're going to go through November or December. I'm not quite sure yet what Sarah Scraps decided for us but um, that is my kit and layout share and I hope to see you for Scraptember with a video a day starting in September and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!